So today we are going to make a slow cooker skirt steak. Um, I like to cook this in the slow cooker because it makes it really tender and I can use it for like flautas, I can use it for just tacos um, and it's really amazing. So this is what you'll need. You'll need skirt steak. I like to get this big one here. It is two and a half pounds. And then these are the seasonings that you'll need. Is the carne asada seasoning, garlic powder, cumin, black pepper, and salt. So literally what we're gonna do is we're gonna put the meat in there and we're gonna season it with all of these here. Okay, so um, the measurements I will actually put at the end of this clip, so that way you have enough time to write everything down. Um, but I just sprinkle it on by hand. It's just, I've done it so many times that I know how much to put in there. Um, I mean, you can't really go wrong because if you just take a look at how much seasoning I'm putting on there, um, it's a, it looks like a lot, but it gives it so much flavor. It's really good. It's not like too salty, um, too flavorful. It's perfect. And I had two pieces in there. Um, you can do one or two. Mine was cut in half, so that's why I had to kind of fold it up. Um, but then I set it to high for four to four and a half hours, just depending on if I'm busy or not. Okay, so I actually left it in there for four and a half hours because I was a little bit busy with the kids. Um, and if you can see that, I was trying to flip it over and it just started falling apart. So it's all getting shredded just as I'm just lifting it up, which is perfect because now you can just shred it all up. And, um, you know, once you shred it, it gets all those juices and all those flavors in every single spot on the meat. So it makes it really good. Um, that's the magic of a slow cooker is that if you're busy, um, if you have things to do, if it keeps cooking, it's not going to burn it. Um, so you could just kind of dump and go and it took us like what five minutes to prep it's amazing and you know you can make this into just tacos with a corn tortilla warm up a corn tortilla or if you want to make it into flautas you put the meat in the corn tortilla roll it up and then fry it in the pan for a little bit and that's perfect i eat that with salsa and sour cream it's amazing um but there it is 